Hey everyone, here's a question. If Chameli had Rs. 600 left after spending 75% of her money, how much did she have in the beginning? So what they have given, they have given that Chameli had spent some amount of money and we don't know how much but they have given percentage of it which is 75%. After spending, she's left with only 600 rupees. What we have to find out, we have to find out how much money was there in the beginning. Means how much amount she had, we have to find out. Now let's write down what we know from the question. So we know the uh, percentage of money she spent. It is 75 percentage, right? And we don't know how much amount she had in the beginning. So that is unknown to us. We're going to assume a variable here. So let the let total amount be x. Total amount be x. Okay. And next, they have given that she has spent 75 percentage of it then how much money is left with her or how much percentage of money is left with her we're going to write down that so percentage of money left with her will be equal to we know the total percentage is 100 percentage right so out of this 100 percentage 100 percentage means the total amount what she had from this she has spent 75 percentage of the amount so if we subtract these two values it will be equal to 25 percentage which means 25 percentage of money is left with her and how much is that it's 600 rupees so we're going to frame the question e the equation here so 25 percentage of the total money total money we don't know we have taken a variable x here so 25 percentage of x is equal to rupees 600 Okay, now it is, we're going to solve this equation, remove the percentage sign, divide by 100. Percentage means out of 100. So whenever you see the percentage sign, remove the percentage sign and divide the number with 100. Of means multiplication and write down the x is equal to rupees 600. Now if we have to find out the x value, I'm going to cancel 25 and 100 in 25 table directly. If you want to cancel it, cancel this in finding table, but at the end you want to get the same answer. I'm going to cancel directly in 25 table, 25 ones are and 25 fours are. Now if you see here, I have a 4 in the denominator and I have 1 in the numerator. So 1 into x will be 1x or simply x. But I don't want this 4 in the denominator, I want to transpose this to the other side. So I'm going to sh I want to shift this. But 4 is in division, when you take this to the other side of the equation, it goes to multiplication. So x will be equal to rupees 600 multiplied by 4, which is equal to rupees 2400 so total 2000 to 2400 rupees she had in the beginning so that is what we're to find out here i hope this question is clear in case you have other questions or doubts you can drop a comment i'll try to make a video on it thank you so much for watching